For a lot of professional actors and actresses, singers and dancers, this summer is special. It's the first time they've been able to perform in front of a live audience since the pandemic began. That was the case for Alyssa Anani. She and Jordan Alexander were cast as the leads in Main State Music Theater's production of Joseph and the Amazing Technicolor Dreamcoat. All that excitement, all that anticipation, the show was up and running. And then came word that several members of the cast and crew have COVID. Today, Main State Music Theater announced that because of COVID, the rest of the run of Joseph and the amazing Technicolor Dreamcoat has been canceled. Our first thought was that we shouldn't run our interview with Alyssa Anani and Jordan Alexander that we planned to air this evening. But when we thought about it some more, we decided it made sense to let you see the enthusiasm and gratitude they had about being able to perform in this production and in turn to get a sense of what they have now lost. We started our conversation by talking about what it was like for Anani to be getting ready for live theater for the first time in more than two years. It was maybe a little scary the first day and then when you're back into the swing of it with the entire company, it was just like a dream. Were you feeling even just a little bit rusty or does it all come back? Probably a little bit rusty <laughs> day one. You're like, please, is it all still there? <laughs> Let's talk a little bit about rehearsals because this is something that most of us in the public don't think about, but they're absolutely maybe the crucial element of what you guys do. If you don't get it right in rehearsals, then it's not going to be right when you stage the actual performances. How long a day do you put in when you're rehearsing? I will work a little bit earlier and we're allowed to work a little bit later on our own if we want, but 10 to 6 right now are the official hours in rehearsal. And it's pretty rigorous. You're, you're really going at it, I assume? The first day we started just like everyone starting vocals. We ran through, I think we did like the first half of the first act all in one day. Yes. Yeah. Which is a lot. It, it's a lot of songs. Like the whole, this whole show is just song after song after song after song. Because there's no dialogue in this show, it's all sung through. Mm -hmm. And so to start day one <laughs> with note number one and make it almost through act one, it's a lot of It's a lyrics. lot of work, yeah. <laughs> Do you have to take special care to protect your voices, your singing voices? Oh, absolutely. What do you do? We conserve when we can, and when we have to turn it on, we turn it on. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and your smoking habit, you've reduced from four packs a day to three? <laughs> yes, absolutely. No, <laughs> do not. Oh my gosh, um, so much tea, so much local honey, mm -hmm. so many electrolyte type, yes. Pedialyte, drinks. Are there things you avoid? I've heard about singers who, for instance, avoid ice cream. Do you do anything like that? Oh, I had three scoops last night. <laughs> <laughs> I would in my dream. If I wasn't lactose intolerant, I would love ice cream, but. <laughs> the show features you as Joseph. Every time a, an actor takes on a new role, there, there's always a challenge, challenges that are part of it. What are the challenges for you in this role? Finding who, how Joseph can stay as positive as he is throughout the whole show. Like he's betrayed by his family and still he forgives them. He's thrown in a prison cell and he's still like, well, I'm gonna make the most of this. The biblical misfortunes just keep piling up, but you have to keep the character positive. Yes. And plausible and believable. Yeah. And so that's gonna be a challenge for me. What are the challenges for you, Alyssa? I think for the narrator, she is the one taking the audience on the journey. I think the challenge for me is the versatility of this show, keeping every song engaged and the audience thinking on their feet every single time. you about one of the things that I know you were doing while things were quiet during the pandemic and that is photography. Yes. You are a skilled photographer, take oh. pictures professionally. If you were around here and you had a few hours, 
and you had a camera in hand, what would you want to take pictures of? Would you want to do some landscapes? Would you want to do buildings? Would you want to hang out at rehearsals or in the theater and, and shoot your fellow performers? What would you do if you had a camera and free time? Can I do all of that? <laughs> uh, I love capturing moments, whether that's from the sunsets here have been absolutely stunning the past few days. I would love to take my camera out, maybe here find trees and find parts of nature, but I would love to get some pictures in rehearsal, would love to get pictures of our friends on the Sound of Music, uh, performing and doing their thing and just those moments in time that won't exist again and that you can hold on to, that's what I really love to capture. So again, the performances of Joseph and the Amazing Technicolor Dreamcoat that were supposed to be happening this week at Main State Music Theater in Brunswick have been canceled because of COVID. The rest of the show, the rest of the run is done. No other shows at the theater, though, have been affected. And I just feel so sorry for everyone involved, particularly, though, these young performers, almost all of whom, like Jordan and Alyssa, they come up from New York. They're so excited to be in Maine. They love to be in Maine in the summer. They haven't been able to practice their craft much lately. They were. You know, they went through the rehearsals. You could see their level of energy. So and then it all comes crashing down once again because of COVID. But as we've learned with COVID, better to be safe than sorry when it comes to this stuff. Yeah, so. the, the rules, the actors' equity rules, that's the union that, that governs live professional right. theater. The rules are very strict, very strict. So they take all kinds of precautions to prevent what has just happened from happening. So. Absolutely. See? Absolutely. All right.